Before I get into this video, I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Andrew2007, a very long time ago at the beginning of my channel. Um, he gave me a shout out, and now that I've kind of grown my channel, I thought it would be uh, fair that I shout him back. So if you guys could go check him out, he just uploads like zombie glitches and other cool glitches for Call of Duty. Um, that would be great, and let's get into the video. What's going on, Smitties and people of the world? It is Patrick here, and welcome to another episode of the Ultimate Zombie Map Challenge, where we are trying to determine the best zombies map ever. In this episode, we have Transit versus Origins. A lot of you guys were asking that I do Origins, so I changed it from Transit versus Buried to Transit versus Origins. If you're new to this, you can go check out how the ranking system and judging system works in the link down below, but let's get into this. The first thing that we have is setup. What map is more fun to get your perks, get your guns, pack a punch, and things of that nature? Transit doesn't do a very good job with this. It's very, very tedious, you know? It takes forever to get jug. It takes even longer to get pack a punch. It's just a hassle over and over, and it's really not that fun. Um, Origins, on the other hand, does a pretty good job. It starts out a little slow, you know, you're just opening doors, but there's so many things that you can do, you know, you have all the staffs to build, you got to turn on the generators. They even added a little individual challenge system, you know, like getting headshots and spending points, uh, things like that, which I really, really do like. You always feel like you have something to do in Origins, um, even by like round 20, so it's great. Um, and for this reason, we give all eight points to Origins. Transit gets zero. The next thing that we have is post setup. You know, once you've gotten all your things and you are going for that high round. Now, transit doesn't really do a good job with this. I find you like get to town or wherever and you just have a feeling of now what? You know, like what do I do now? It just gets really, really boring. Um, Origins doesn't do an amazing job with this, but it's certainly, certainly better than transit. So for that, we're going to give Origins uh, four points and transit two. Next, we want to look at difficulty. What map is closer to that perfect level of not too hard, not too easy? Um, Origins is actually quite a difficult map. I'd say probably the hardest for uh, Black Ops 2. And yes, the, the more experienced players like this, but as an overall look at the map, you know, for everybody, um, I think the majority of people are having trouble with this map. Um, whereas Transit was a little bit on the easy side. So I think um, this is quite balanced and we're gonna give both sides an even three points. From here, we're gonna start looking at innovativeness towards the map. Um, and the first thing that we have for this is guns. Now, Transit, yes, they did bring the whole new Black Ops 2 set of guns in, but that doesn't count. We're looking at like, you know, special guns, wonder weapons, things like that. And really, they didn't bring a whole lot in. They had Galvan Knuckles, I'll give them that and they had the EMP grenade, and that's really it. Not very impressive. Now, Origins, on the other hand, had all the staffs, you know, the ultimate staffs. It's amazing, it's amazing. They also have probably the best camo ever. Um, for that, we have to give all four points to Origins. Moving on from here, we have perks. Um, Origins has no new perks, but it had the Wonder Fizz machine, which is a pretty cool thing. Um, on the other hand, Transit did bring a new perk in, which was Tombstone. Not the best perk, but it is new. Um, and I think this is pretty even on both sides, so both maps get two points. Now next up we have Bosses. Transit's Avogadro, or the Electro Boss Zombie, was really, really unique. He was a powerful opponent, unless you were a smart player and used the Galvan Knuckles or the EMP Grenades. Um, Origins Panzer Solat is unique in the sense of, you know, his little gadgets and things, but it feels like Brutus. It feels like Brutus is chasing you around the map. It really does, you know, just another big guy that you got to shoot in the head. Um, and for that reason, I don't think he is the most unique uh, boss out there. Um, and we're going to give two and a half points to, or, or sorry, two and a half points to Transit and one and a half points to Origins on this one. Lastly, for innovativeness, we just have an overall uh, look at the map out of eight points. Now, Origins did a lot of cool things. You know, they had the staffs, you can upgrade them, um, you know, the generators, the Templar zombies, the new characters coming, or the, sorry, the old characters, but young, I mean, you know, all that stuff was really, really cool. Transit had buildables, though. Huge, huge thing. The bus route, also a unique thing. Uh, not the most liked, but it was very unique. And I really feel that this is quite even. You know, it's a really tough call. Um, so we're going to give both sides an even four points. Now, moving on to storyline. Um, Origins is probably considered to be one of the worst storylines in map history. 
it's not very good. You know, it's just a really, really big cop out, which is considered by most people. Um, and, you know, even personally, I don't like it very much. Um, Transit, on the other hand, is, you know, the beginning of the new characters. It's not an amazing storyline. You know, they just meet up and, you know, they start talking to Rick Toff and all that stuff. It's not a crazy unique, but it is better. It is much better than uh, Origins. So for this, we're going to give four points to Transit at one point to Origins. Now, finishing up, we have the all or nothing bonus round of five points. And that category is the zombie feel factor. What map just feels more like an old school, you know, great fun game of zombies? Transit, you know, they went on a limb. They tried to do something different and it wasn't well received. For that reason, it has to go to Origins. Guys, this is a great map. We had the return of the old characters, which was something very looked forward to. It's a really good map. It really is just really fun. We're going to look back to this and think it's one of the better ones. And it gets the five points. All right, guys, that is it for my end. We have Transit at 17 and a half points and Origins at 32 and a half. I now leave it up to you to determine what map is better. Just comment in the section below um, what map you prefer. Please, no bias, you know, just say what map you think is better um, and all that good stuff. If you're new to the channel, you know, subscribe. If you're enjoying this series, please leave a like rating. Have a wonderful day. Go follow me on Twitter and I will talk to you later. Peace out.